Wait, wait, wait. Considering what we have here on the screen, that elephant should be more like this. Let's try that again. Hold on. Ah, it's, I used to be able to do it and do it very well. Hold on. One more time. I'm going to try one more time. I like that. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Uh, anyway, what's up, guys? Welcome back. Uh, it's your boy Midnight coming to you from the Midnight Cinema. Please do me a favor. Uh, hit that like button. Hit the you know, subscribe button. Please trying to get these numbers up. Um, I'm sitting right now with 69 subscribers. Uh, just want to be able to, you know, at least before, let's say before my birthday, let's get 100 subscribers. Okay, let's hit 100. Um, but yes, today's a great day. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm glad to have, you know, people join me, uh, just to, you know, tune in and watch. So th this will be a fun one. So just a little bit of backstory before I dive into the actual review. Uh, so as a kid and even now I've always loved elephants, like always, always loved elephants. And so in kindergarten, when we had our graduation, funny story, my mother tells us all the time, but, um, our teacher, she was going down the line asking us what we wanted to be when we grew up. So. Uh, someone said a pastor, someone said a doctor, someone said a lawyer, someone said a nurse, someone said a teacher, someone said a police officer. And it goes down the line until they get to me. And what do I say? I said that I wanted to be an elephant. And yes, I'd be a phenomenal elephant. Bear my tusks, raise my trunk and trumpet as the loudest one in the herd. And one of the movies that actually uh, spurned that love of elephants for me and even my further love for animals was whispers in elephant's tail a movie that i just watched the other day i hadn't seen since i was a kid okay like i had not seen since i was i i mean my goodness what like i think the last time i might have seen it i was in second grade maybe but it's been a while and i had a thought about it the other day and then i noticed it and i remembered i'm like oh wait this is a disney movie it should be on Disney Plus. And lo and behold, I go on Disney Plus and what do I see? This right here, this glorious gem of a film. I love this movie. Uh, so pretty much this is the tale of a baby elephant who's just been born, living life on the savannah. And then he gets separated from his mother after these poachers or takers, as they call them in the movie, uh, pretty much. <clears throat> Uh, they, they get separated. So he finds another herd, forms a bond with this other female elephant in another herd named Groove, played by or voiced by Angela Bassett. And uh, it, it's they go on this journey to pretty much, you know, avoid the poachers, avoid all the dangers that lie within you know, the African savannah. You got predators stalking them, lions, hyenas. When they cross the rivers, you got crocodiles. It's it's such a journey, and the score and soundtrack is so good. Johnny Clegg and Savuka, I've always loved their African music, and I tried, uh, I think, what's his name, Trevor, Trevor Blant, I think, or Trevor, Trevor Balin, he was the one that did the uh, soundtrack for this movie, and it's, it's really well done. Love the score, love every single thing about it. I... <laughs> just this tale of this this young elephant and, and the journey that he goes on and you know the reason why he's called whispers is because like he can't really if you've ever seen trumpet of the swan he was a mute swan and but he could only play the he could play the trumpet just couldn't make noises come out of his you know his vocals so uh whispers he can't really trumpet or send up a signal uh be I, I can't, ex they don't really like, he just wasn't able to for a while. And then towards the end, um, when they are in absolute danger, when these poachers are about to slaughter every last one of them, um, he raises his trunk and boom, does it. I didn't remember, I remembered a few things from this movie, but like, I didn't remember every single piece of the story and it was emotional. There was a point where I definitely did shed a few tears, uh, it's it's so good. I I really love this movie and the way it's shot. It's shot like a documentary, but they have the voiceovers for people uh, it's like Angela Bass. So you see the actual footage, right? This is like you know documented footage, and so they have voice actors pretty much 
portray the characters that we see on screen. And there's so many of I mean, Kevin Michael Richardson is actually the adult version of Whispers, which I thought was awesome. Uh, Angela Bassett, who I forgot was in this, she voices Groove, the one that um, Whispers ends up finding and takes... Uh, <clears throat> forms another bond with uh and debbie derryberry you know jimmy neutral <laughs> uh, um yeah uh so she actually does the voice of whispers and she's a talented voice actor by the way i've always loved her work and everything that she's been in uh Deb- debbie derryberry yeah she's she's really good and, and this and, and she was big then too i mean this came out in 2003 and jimmy neutral was running so she had to be doing these at the same time but yes, um, this is one of my all-time favorites. Had to go back, revisit it, and watch it. And, you know, I loved it every last second. And I see someone to my left who has just entered the fray. It is live video, kid. It's a review, yes. This is Whispers. Am I going to edit this? No, you're staying in this video. <laughs> it's my sister, ladies and gentlemen. She understands the way. What before you leave? What is your favorite animal? Mm. A panda or a penguin? You know what? That's wild. That is true. That is true. Black and white. A warrior of black and white, and a flightless bird of black and white. One with happy feet. One destined to be the dragon warrior. Speaking of, you got to check out that Kung Fu Panda. Uh, they got a new series on with Jack Black coming back on Netflix. Yeah, yeah, it came out yesterday. Jack Black is back, baby. I don't know how we just dove, dove into Jack Black, but this this is great. Uh huh. Kiss from a rose. Oh yeah, but no, 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 that was Seal. Yeah, Seal did that one. You know, I don't know. Was he in the video? Somebody tell me if he was in the video. Kiss from a rose. Yeah, that was from Batman Forever. Val Kilmer. Yes, we love the knowledge, ladies and gentlemen. Well. No, yeah, but yes, Whispers, guys. Love that movie. Love this since I was a kid, and um, I just had to revisit it. And honestly, it touched on a lot of very important things, things that I hate on American Idol. I got to find that video. I'm going to find that video. Maybe I'll react to it. That'll be one we should do. All right, then. Oh, okay, you just going to stand there? (laughs) Oh, but yeah, so it's just the only thing I just, I hate poachers. And I can say that I know hate is a strong word. I don't use hate for a lot of things, but I actively and violently hate poachers uh, because you are killing nature with no regard for life in any way, shape or form. Uh, Like a lot of elephants over the years have, I mean, the population is dwindling in Africa. When this movie was out, apparently there were 660,000 left in the wild. I'm pretty sure that number is way less today because of the ivory trade and everything and you know me and kevin uh brother riverside as you've seen in a video we've done previously um we've we've talked about this in depth on and off camera but but i want to put an end to poaching i really do and this movie just kind of touches on it in other ways uh it's hurtful It it really it really is to see life be treated like that if, if if you can't have respect for life or if you're if you're going to kill something and then not actually use it or consume it or whatever then why do it in the first place you just do it for senseless greed uh and it's one of the biggest trades out there and i i, I can't stand it i wish other countries and i wish we would take bigger steps to put a uh end to it overall but anyway that got dark but uh that all i'm saying is yes thank you for the claps um yeah, all I'm saying is go check out this movie. It's on Disney+. Plus. You'll love it. You will love this little elephant. I had a stuffed elephant, by the way, when I was a kid, and I actually named it Whispers. I did, because I love this movie that much. I, I, she, she can confirm. I love this movie that much. But anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And comment. Please comment. I love to hear feedback. Yes. She will come for you. All right. She will. She will come after every single one of you. She can. All right. <laughs> Boom. I tried. I, I did it several times before the video started. It's okay. <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.